Subscribe to Buccaneer Bry now. Hello, it's me. Thing one, the tomato hornworm caterpillar. And these other caterpillars' names are Thing two and Thing three. Thing three is the smallest one here who recently shedded his skin. Well, I'd like to tell you a little bit about myself. So, I turn into a type of sphinx moth, or hawk moth. Not a butterfly like the monarch and painted lady caterpillars. Well, one question you might have, am I toxic to humans? Since this guy is holding me. Well, I am harmless if you touch me, but I can be toxic to eat after I eat my tomato plant. Well, you might be wondering if I have any predators. Of course I do. They would usually be several types of lizards, including anole lizards. They really love me. So that's why I'm only staying outside of my habitat for a little bit, otherwise the lizards might sneak up on us and eat us. We don't want that to happen. Well, you might be wondering what other host plants we have besides tomatoes. Most of the plants we eat are in the nightshade family. We also eat peppers, eggplants, and tobacco, depending what type we are. And we breathe out the nicotine and tobaccos through these brown holes you see on our sides. They are called spiracles. They play a big role in our system. Well, I do not have as many legs as you think I do. I only have six legs and they are only near my head capsule. The rest of these are not legs. They are pro legs. I have them to hold on to things. You might see me holding on to very thin things by clipping my pro legs together. Well, I also have this little horn at the back of me. Although it look, may look like something that may prick you, it won't really hurt you. And that's what gives me the name Hornworm. Well, I hope you enjoyed this introduction to tomato hornworms. I'll see you later.